What's up ladies and gents, I'm Legion 27 and welcome your faces back to another episode of Total War Warhammer 2, the Lizardman campaign. So, uh, it has been, I kind of forgot uh, Friday's episode so I do apologize about that, so it's been a little while since the last episode, but I'm going to try and get back on schedule Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I believe at 12pm U.S. Central Time. So, anyways, uh, we get some new unit names, very happy about that. Uh, we have Swamp Guard and the Bone Breakers for the Crux scores. We have Terror Squadron and I think Jero Squadron. Is it is our Jero Squadron or Jero Squad, uh, Squadron? But um, those are the Pterodons. And then last but not least, we have the Dino Headhunters for the Skinks. So, all right, let's get back to this. I believe we uh, are done, if I am correct, or we're about to be. Let's see, we've gotten to these. I think we have a clear shot to kill them off. So I think we should probably take that chance before, well, these guys come up and try to attack us. But at the same time, it would be easier to do this all on open field. Hmm. But of course they do have great eagles and I'd rather not have to deal with them. So let's just go Straight into the battle. Straight into the battle. Might as well. Alright, I'm actually uh, doing this really early in the morning. It's Sunday morning right now. 6.16 a.m. And I have to go to church around 9 o'clock a.m. So I'm going to try to get three episodes done before I have to go. Mostly because I don't want to have to uh, worry about it during the week, and I also have other things to do, things to uh, prepare. And this will be pr practically my last week of recording until um, until after Christmas, because I'll be going out to my parents for a little over a week and staying with them for the holidays. So, gonna be fun. All right, that took a little bit longer than I wanted to, but it wills. Let's see. Pretty easy uh, siege, I believe, so let's just uh, actually take this away. Always make that just in case. Okay, you guys are gonna take the front entrance right here, including, well, let's see. Yeah, might as well bring you up. Oh no, let's see, how, how far can you shoot? Pretty frickin' far. These guys are like, uh, mobile sea- uh, not really siege artillery, but they are definitely artillery because look at the size of that crossbow and those bolts on the side. That is ridiculous. So, we're gonna bring in the Croxagores. I was gonna bring in the, uh, the ancient Stegodon, but decided not to. Bring these guys back, make sure they don't kill it off. And we will send in two of you on this side, two of you on this side, take the walls, and then we'll keep you guys back for now. Same with the riders. Also, did I ever give these guys a name? No, I have not. Okay. And for you, you can charge up with them. Might as well. Alright, I think this is good enough. Let's go. They do not have a slither of a chance to win this. We need to kill them quickly and as swiftly as possible. So my lizards do not get tired. So how far can they shoot? They can shoot freaking far. Holy crap. Oh, and they're going to be your strain range. I do not like that. Let's get these guys back here a little bit more. Looks like they're going to be focus firing on the Croxagores. Actually, yeah, focus firing on the Croxagores and on my general. Uh, Megasaur, the Elf Slayer, going to do his duty here. God. My dudes will not go down without a freaking fight. Swamp dwellers. Yeah. 
It's true. We like the swamps. Makes our uh, scaly skin feel nice and smooth. Or scalier. Either one. Oh. There we go. Dang, these guys can take a freaking hit. Let's go, boys! Onto the ladders! Take those walls! Say the more. God, I love how many troops just fall off. Check that out. Alright. So yeah, these guys are gonna be... ...taking some hits. But that's okay, let's bring up our pterodons. Might as well bring you guys up as well. Oh, we've already taken the uh, gates. Go ahead, boys. Break through. Go, go, go. Alright. Now bring these guys in. You know what? Bombs away. For you guys. Right about there. Good job. Holy crap, we have literally just destroyed them. As we should. Look at that, just nothing's left. Here come my reinforcements. Waddling in. Probably should send these guys in one at a time because they like to get in each other's way. Alright, send the next. Archers doing their best to hold us back, but it shall be futile. Alright, take them off the ground. I mean, take it off the wall. Put them on the ground. Right, let's get these guys over here. Beautiful. I kind of want to see him uh, fire the crossbow. Just randomly fire it. Alright, very good stuff. We have lost a couple of my temple guard over here. I think it is time to bring in you. And we also need to bring in these boys. Of course the skinks. Let's go skinkies. Alright, very good. Take him out. These guys are in full retreat. Get them off the walls. We've taken the walls. Next, the city. Right. Doesn't look like they have any more archers, but those reavers, not pretty. Go, go, go. Move into the city. There they go. Bombs away. They truly think their phalanx is gonna work on us. I think not. Let's 
bring you up. Do another healing on you. We'll bring in the riders. Not a chance. Olas Inc. I kind of want someone to make like a meme of a skink riding a pterodon. Not a pterodon, but a. Uh, what do you guys call it? A stegodon. Uh, riding a stegodon with some sunglasses and like probably some. Uh, like. Uh, a soon tie. And a uh, pistol being like, Ula skink! That would be great. Kind of like a mob. Mob dude. There we go. All right, we have taken the city with minimum, minimum losses. 48 losses in total. Not too shabby. How did we do on kills? I need to get those numbers up. 142 looks like. Nope, 151 is the most so far, and it is. Nice. Of course, zero is the least. God, I can't. Good job. We have taken the city with minimum hassle. And I think, let's see. Let's get one for Stegadon. Oh, and of course you. Uh... Oh. oh, yeah, we might as well uh, keep the stake on, if that's the case. Attribute stock. This unit can move hidden in any terrain. Yeah, pterodon. Going pterodactyl. All right. Mm. I'm gonna say. I want you to survive a little bit longer in these battles. Alright, so I think we're good here. And we've practically done all of our turns. So we are almost done with this freaking menace. Known as the High Elves. Now, of course, eventually we'll go after the Dark Elves. I mean, not Dark Elves. Why do you come? What can we help? The Elves, so. Uh, vampires. The Vampire Coast. Oh! I'll take that. I kinda wanna go through every city real quick. Oh! Well, that's the thing. Um. I think you're gonna be more immediate danger, so let's get you. Get this. Get that. Good. It does give me income from all buildings. It's the only reason why I want to keep it. But at the same time, I do not. Alright. So, anyways, let's continue. Fast forward this. High Elves and Ulthwan look like I have been growing more and more. That's not exactly the best thing I want to see. That is okay. I'll take it. Take it out as a challenge. And they are winning this fight. Very strong, very strong week, and then... I actually really like this. It just tells you how much money they have and such. Oh. Well. Let's go, Skinks. We can take them on. We have really uh, very powerful Skinks here, too. Skink Great Crests, Clubs and Spears, and then, of course, Blowpipes. Not too shabby. I kind of want Source Warriors, but these will have to do. Kind of surprised they have a uh, force strong enough to even go after one of my cities. I mean, they were going to attack me anyway, but still. 
But hey, that has the coward's way out. there. Oh, wait, we can get all the way up. Boom. Hola, skink. Alright, go, go, go. Just surround them. We'll be fine. Alright, get these skinks up here. Go. Surround them. Go, skinks, go! Get out of our lands. Pointy eared freaks. Lothon Sea God with shields, nonetheless. They are killing our skinks quite, uh, quite well. Not liking that at all. Oh, let's get these guys up here. Let's go, go, go. All right. No, they're not supposed to escape. Uh, that's what you guys are for. In behind them. Make sure they don't get away. I don't know what the heck they're doing. Get them, get them good. Alright. Reinforcements are coming, so we need to prepare for that. Skinks are taking a bit of damage, not liking that whatsoever. But let's prepare for the second round. Yeah, kill him. Actually, kill him. That will lower morale. Reinforcements! Feels so nonchalant about it. It's like, hmm, just another day. Alright. Move and kill, move and kill. Run! Okay, how much health do you have left? 151. Just. Everyone, fire upon him now. And he should be dead in 3, 2, 1. Boop! Get him! There we go. Very nice. That Red Ribbon Spearman holding us off pretty well. Alright. Zaya dead. So is he. Make sure he dies in this fight. I don't care how you do it. Just do it. Do it. Alright. Get these kings moving. Go, 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 go. Take him down to size. Skink size, preferably. Come on, do it, 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 do it. Nope, skinks get over here. There we go. And the battle. It's the only one I needed. Everyone else can leave. Right.
right, it's very nice to experience. Oh, hello. You're right there. Shush, shush, shush. Ooh. Peace treaty? Peace treaty. Oh. After I slaughter your kin. Or after he slaughters me. Either one. One more battle. One more. That was probably going to be the end of the episode. <laughs> Not too much this episode, but lots and lots of battles. I'm pretty sure we can take them. Hold them off. Hopefully we'll be able to, uh... Hold. Got the ancient stick it on. What are the things I have not ancient stick it on, or just? I think they're just stick it on. Yeah. These are ancient stick it on. Just by this. I don't know why I call the other ancient stick it on, but we do have this guy and this guy. I want to see what he does. I mean, I know what he does, but I want to see him in action. Is what I'm trying to say. All right. Saint Slurpee. Because it's gr because he's green, I may call him uh, Pepe. Why not? By the way, what is this? Holy Stella. Interesting. Yeah, here they come. So let's look at one particular unit real quick. This guy. He's uh he's a purple purplish red. Is that because he's in he's in the cold or something? I don't know, but. Check this guy out. And then, of course, the ancient Stegodon. God. So sexy. Alright. Enough. Enough with that. Prepare for battle. Let them come to us. And then... Actually, yeah, you need to be up here. You spread all these guys out. And... Boop. I think that's all of them. Yeah. Let's go. Kind of want to look at these guys as well. Ooh, look at their tails. That's cool. All nice and bladed. Um, hold on a second. Why are you going all the way over there? You... Here. Easy. And of course, you guys... Here. Boom. Boomtastic. Very nice. Do you even have a name? Yeah, I haven't given him one yet, so yeah, he's probably going to be named Pepe. Because why not? Am I right? Oh, that's cool. Has a certain number of replenishments, he just doesn't replenish all the time. Alright. Go after his bowls. Not his bowls, his bulls. I, I can't. I can't even talk. Oh, hello. Alright, you guys come over here. Don't forget, you're the one who attacked me, not the other way around. Oh, they're not, uh, gold bull. Gold bulls, they are, uh, something far worse. Gore bull. I'm, like, slurring my words together, it's weird. Okay, of course. Nothing out of the ordinary. Alright, got you. these guys so they don't surround me. Oh, lovely. Hello. Alright, go 
Go over and kill him. You. Go over there, because you're fast. There it goes. For you. Okay, not an air unit. Oh, I know an air unit. Where you go? Oh, okay. I don't see him anymore, but... Let's do... That. Let's get you right about... Let's pull you back a little bit. Whee! Ha 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 ha. I killed the rest. Also, our guys were very tired. That sucks. Sometimes they like... They're like not tired for some odd reason. That's weird. Okay, where's this guy? Oh, he can individually heal things. Okay. Interesting. You boys. Get over here. Kill them off. Spread them out. You like a sandwich. Spread it. Good lads. Right, get behind. Get behind, and you guys can decide as well. Honestly, I don't need all of you guys going after them. Just a few. Heal yourself. You come over here and heal. Other peeps. I think that should be all of them. Free! Free, beastmen! Kind of hurt some of my own troops, but all good. Do your magical stuff. Pew! Yay! All right. Yeah, get over here. Heal those fools. I want to see this healing thing in action. Yeah, just keep chasing them. Keep chasing them. Never had a chance. Yeah, you look like you were the most beaten up. Come on. Heal, 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 heal. There we go. Now watch this number go up. Actually, I want to... Well, that's pretty rapid. I want to know if it actually... Let's see. Yeah, Resurrects Dead Combatants. That's a pretty good amount of uh, time for healing, too. Seven more seconds. Oh, I want to see them heal all the way. Oh well. Good amount of kills from everyone. 148. Good job, guys. Those were the best they could throw at us. So sad. You know, I actually really like the Beastman faction. To me, they're a very, very fun faction to play as. I suggest anyone who does have 
Warhammer 1 or Warhammer 2, uh, go play as the Beastmen. I think you have to have the uh, Beastmen. Uh, I think it's like the Wood Elves and the Beastmen. Um, no, no, it's just it's just Beastmen. Beastmen DLC. I thought it was a combined, but it's not. Uh, bless spawn, uh, spawning uh, three bless swords, spear shields. Oh, ambush and defeat. Ah, ah sick. It's good. I didn't do peace then, because I would have never gotten that. All right. So to end this off, also you, first of all. Hey. Is that how you spell Pepe? This land. Alright. That. <laughs> Tell me in the comments if I actually uh, spelled that right. If not, I'll change it. It's not that big of a deal. Uh, wind blast. There we go. Slaughter him. Be done with it. Cool beans. Now we could Let's see. They're probably gonna go after this, which we should be able. Yeah, we should be able to hold it off. Definitely, uh, with the size of their army, we should be able to hold them off. Um. Let's do a round self. Well, let's, let's buff our dudes first. And then we'll make them more uh, powerful. Pepe the Slan. So I think that's actually going to be it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please come on, like, and subscribe as I finish up right here. And thank you for everyone who has supported me so far on this series and has been very patient for these videos to come out. So. Anyways, love you all, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.